Hey y'all, it's Brady. Welcome to my channel and thank you so much for joining me and welcome to another video. So if you're new here, hi, hello, and welcome. We are a family of four. It is myself, my husband, and our two girls. My husband works full-time crazy hours. I work part-time plus, excuse me, plus YouTube, plus running a household and all sorts of stuff going on. The kids are in school full-time. Y'all know how it is. We're busy, just like the rest of y'all. And on my channel, I like to share our what's for dinner videos, what I'm buying at the grocery store, and a little bit of our daily life. So if that's your sort of thing, I would love for you to hit that subscribe button and stick around. And uh, if you are not new and you are returning, well, hi, hello, and I'm so glad you are back. Today, we have got a Kroger grocery haul. I also have a few things from Target that Kroger did not have. And so I just placed a little drive up order. I did do a Kroger click list order. And I believe my total, she said, was $135 after the things that they were out of stock on. And then it was $31 and some change at Target. So we are right on Target with our budget this week. Let me share with you what I got and uh, I'll try to remember the prices as well. Okay, so here is a look at everything on the table. Again, about $166 and some change. So we'll round up, say $167 altogether. And definitely got quite a bit. Um, it still seemed like things were pretty expensive, but I did have some coupons. So I had two $5 off a pickup order coupons that came off, uh, digital coupons. And then also a $10 off a $75 pickup or delivery purchase um, that came off as well. So that saved me $20. Um, plus there were some digital coupons at Kroger for... Uh, the cheese and the bagels and the oranges, a couple of things, apples, different things like that. So let's just get into it. Eggs were $4.99 and then you could get up to five with the digital coupon of the Kroger 8 ounce cheese packages. I did get two extra though, um, so I think they were $2.29 each, but I got one of the Swiss slices, one mozzarella block, two Monterey Jack blocks, one shredded whole milk mozzarella, and then two of the shredded cheddar jack. So um, that's a good deal on, on cheese. So I went on ahead and stocked up. Okay, uh, $2.79 for the Hostess Donuts Frosted Chocolate Mini Donuts. Three gallons of whole milk, those were $3.89 a gallon. Two gallons of Milo sweet tea, $3.79 a gallon. Two gallons of half sweet tea, half lemonade, uh, $3.79 a gallon. This I had to get at Kroger because, or at Target because I forgot to order it, but it's the Jimmy Dean fully cooked turkey sausage patties. Kroger, the flaky jumbo canned biscuits for my husband's breakfast. Um, we have cheese slices already, but the eggs the turkey sausage and the buttermilk biscuits um, are for his breakfast in the morning for my husband. These canned biscuits were $1.69. $9.49 a pound, and looks like this would end up being $10.15 for the Boar's Head Oven Roasted No Salt Added Turkey, and I got that shaved. Um, what else? Okay, the Thomas brand bagels were, and the Thomas Swirl Bread, these were all buy one, get one free. The Sara Lee bread was as well. So it made them all half off. So the cinnamon swirl bread was $2.47. These bagels, the mini bagels, the chocolate chip ones were $2.47 or $2.74 maybe. But I did have a $2 off any Thomas brand product. So we'll just use these for instance. These were 74 cents. $2.14 after the half off sale on the Sara Lee white with whole grain bread. I ordered another brand that I had a coupon on. And so I'm not sure how much I actually got charged for these. But these brioche hamburger buns, the Kroger private selection ones from their bakery area is what they substituted. And I said that was fine. Again, the cinnamon squirrel bread, some plain bagels. Um, I, I did try to make homemade bagels last weekend, still trying to perfect that. They, they didn't come out just exactly how I'd like, so we're going to try that again, but for the time being, since they were half off, I did buy bagels. And then the Mission Yellow Corn Tortillas, I forgot to order these at Kroger, so I added them to the Target pickup, and these were $2.19 for the 24 count. 
I did get two English cucumbers for $1.49 each at Kroger, some organic basil for margarita pizza, homemade pizza night, and this was, there was like a 20 cent off coupon or 50 cents off coupon, I don't know, um, off the Simple Truth Organic Herbs, which is, this is the only brand of herbs that my Kroger carries, so it really doesn't matter, but it made this like a dollar seventy nine, I believe, for some basil. And yes, I know that if you have a garden, you're likely scare screaming at me that <laughs> Brady, get a garden. That's ridiculous to pay that. I agree, y'all. I agree. You could buy a plant for that and then you know have it forever. So that is something that I am going to be working on this spring, and hopefully that is going to cut back our produce prices. Um, okay. Baby carrots for a pound was at 99 cents. This was a dollar 69 or a dollar 79, dollar 99, something like that, under two dollars. I had ordered the Kroger brand hot fudge sauce to go with that vanilla ice cream that I bought last week. Funny story, um, they substituted Smuckers and I said that was fine. I believe they gave me the Kroger brand price though. Anyways, um, <laughs> I got that ice cream last week. The kids had been asking for some vanilla ice cream. And then I thought, ooh, we have some hot fudge in the fridge. Yeah, it was expired. So, bought some. <laughs> so, there's that. Okay. Um, so, now Mama gets to have her treat of, you know, my one bowl of ice cream that I'll want. And then I'll be done with it. But, at least we'll have some hot fudge. Okay. Okay. 49 cents each, no, 45 cents each at Target for some limes. That is cheaper than our Kroger. 50 cents each for these white onions. I got two of those at Kroger. 79 cents at Kroger for a green bell pepper. 4.49 for the three pack of romaine hearts. 2.29 or 2.79 for a head of iceberg lettuce. Four. Bananas, those were 59 cents pound. This eight pound bag of navel oranges was on sale with a digital coupon this week at Kroger for $3.99. As well as this three pound bag of Envy apples were $3.99 with a digital coupon. So I did go ahead and get those um, because we need some apples and oranges. As you can see, our top basket over there is empty. So it's time to fill those up and I was excited that those were on sale. And then, it's kind of hard to see, but this is the bone-in skin on chicken. These were on sale for $1.49 a pound this week at Kroger. So, I got four of these large packages. I think it ended up being like $25 total for all, all four packages. And I'm actually going to, um, I'll probably take one package and freeze them individually, but then I will actually... Um, boil and shred the rest, make broth, shredded chicken, all that stuff for the freezer, and package that up. And that goes a long way. Um, ramen, 19 cents each for the soy sauce flavor. Got two of those. Beef, 19 cents for two of those each. And then these were 39 cents for the uh, chicken flavor. So, I got two of those. Uh, veggie chips, I ordered veggie straws. They substituted veggie chips. That's fine. That was $2.29 after a digital coupon at Kroger. The Poppables White Cheddar was $1.99 with a digital coupon at Kroger. They were all out of all brands of almond milk, chocolate almond milk. So, I did pay more. It was like $3.40 and I got four of them um, for the Silk Dark Chocolate Almond Milk from Target. Target also, I got the Kool-Aid Jammers 10 Count Blueberry for $3.69 or $2.69. The watermelon lime, Good and Gather brand, three, I think no, three nineteen I think or three twenty nine for that, and then the fruit by the foot was twenty five percent off, so I paid right at two dollars for that little box at Target, and then I got some spiral cut French fries from Kroger for three thirty nine. Uh, three ninety nine for the twenty four count chocolate chip waffles from Kroger. $2.50 for the Eggo mini waffles, the cinnamon toast ones from Target. And then another fried rice seasoning packet was $1.19 at Kroger. And then I did order some more of these 90 second rice pouches. These are $1.25 right now. I got two jasmine and then I ordered 
two of these cilantro lime rice, um, but they had to substitute the Uncle Ben's or Ben's original brand um, for that, for one of them. So that was fine, especially because I believe I paid the $1.25 still. So that's a really good price, really good thing to have on hand, helps us not eat out when we have a quick alternative. And so yeah, that's everything that I got this week for $167 between Kroger and Target. With what we have in our pantry and freezers, we should be good to go. So that's everything I've got. Thank you so much for joining me. Leave me a comment down below. Let me know how you're doing and uh, what you're shopping for and what's on your meal plan. Thank you again for being here and I will see you in the comments down below until our next video. Bye y'all.